Uh, no, that's not the one. Hmm. You harvest when you don't own the, the the space and it's not in your territory. Like if I walked over to the elephants, I could have a scout harvest the elephants and we would get a benefit. That's for manually harvesting, not as part of a city's under control resources. I'm going to wait a turn and we'll, 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 we'll look again next turn just so I can make sure that it's not just an interface thing with I uh, have to wait for them to actually be produced for a turn or something. Alright, so done. More discontent. Okay, you go get more lavender. Oh, garrison. Need the garrison for the governor. It's also going to take a ton of uh, stone. I do want to garrison up here. I, I foresee fights with Rome eventually. Nabu. And we need governors. All right, so we got another quarry done. Let's see. The plan is... Oh, crap. What was the plan? <laughs> I put a, a mill there. These three could benefit. Yeah, we want the lumber mill here to benefit from the water. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. All right, and there's our olives also. What's this game about? It's uh, it's old world. <laughs> Whoops! I'm getting picked on. I'm getting picked on. The vandals have converted to Judaism. All right. So we got our our uh, our war elephant. Next up, there's that coinage they were pointing me at. So we're looking at ten years for uh, research in those categories. I can't seem to generate enough civics to uh, keep up with the laws. Um, get the older ones. Origin of the state. Cato, the great thinker and politician in Akkad, comes forward with a text chronicling the story of Babylonia. So it's a culture event. So we can either make it available to all plus 120 culture, so it'll speed up the next culture event. That's kind of funny when you, you get a culture event and your reward is progress to the next culture event. <laughs> or bury the document to protect those involved. All families plus 40 opinion for 20 years. I would like to get him in the court, but um, we're going to take the family opinion. Super important. Last time it ran away from me, and uh, I, I had bad times. Look at that. Look at that. It's in nice glowing green. 240, 206. Unfortunately, those are going to go down. <laughs> we're offsetting the, uh, 
the the discontent with our legitimacy plus 191 from legitimacy minus 160 from discontent but negative discontent is going to eventually overtake us though if i don't find other ways missing luxuries i know i'm going to try to fix that this turn and guys are picking on my elephants again they came way out to get my elephants i'm kind of surprised all right where do the other elephants appear where where are you at, free elephants? All right, where are we gonna send these guys? He's got that fight finished, and he's holding up really well against these guys now with all the upgrades I gave him. But do I send the second elephant down to finish this area, or roll him forward to help the front? I think I'm gonna roll him forward. It's more important that I secure these, get the cities down for my border with Carthage over here. And we'll do a later cleanup of this area. Nobody's going to get to that but me. So, a lot of points to get these elephants forward. Okay, it's going to only make it to there on normal movement. All right, hold on a second. Let's do this stuff first. Camel archers and the elephant can kill that unit between them. Elephant can almost do it by himself. Um, how far can you guys fire? What is that? One, two, three. All right, we're going to have to mop these two up. So let's do that. I'm going to wait on you. Kill that state, that place again. <laughs> this time I'll try to remember and not let it flip again. You are going to come forward to there. So I'm having a really hard time with this decision on these settlers. It's the only two I've got completed. I really want to plant them there and there. <laughs> but i got to have somebody come sit on this. I might have to bring this worker over to sit on this site for a while. Let's go ahead and uh, bring you forward a bit. You. Choices, choices. i got three workers in this city? Really? How did I manage that? Is this a new worker? This must be a new worker. Uh, I'm going to send you over to a cod. And let's get... Oops. Out of points. 15 orders left. Holy crap. I need more units. I say until I get into... A, I start moving military units around and then have no orders left. Weird trying to balance that. It's it's feast or famine. You have way too few or way too many sitting around. All right, so we've still got the elephant here to deal with. Um, yeah, we're going to let that guy try to deal with it. So we're going to bring you forward. Let's. Uh, we're maxed out on training rate. Let's have some fun. Let's move. Then force march. I've got uh, 12 extra points, do I? <laughs> I can get all the way down here. I can get to right there. Or we can bring him up this way to help this guy. Nah, we want to overwhelm the defense down here. We're just going to try to smash through this and this. I am so tempted to drop this city just so I can quickly set the elephant back and get it to full health again. Yeah. 
I think I'm going to do that. Let's found the city. Doesn't really do me any good to have the uh, settler just sitting around. Uh, who's up next? One, two, three, one, two, one, two. So anybody except Issen. All right. So not not those guys. The artisans, mines and lumber mills. Uh, this place is going to have a horrible time. Or the sages. Both the sages. All right, so we'll step the elephant back, get him fully healed, bring the other elephant down. So you going to bring to there now. I have less orders available to me. Yeah, right there is good. Orm, of course. All right, that gets us two elephants. This guy, I also need to take a turn to get a general added on and do some promotions. Oh, yeah. Love focus on my elephants. <laughs> They're hilarious. Maybe finally we can finish this eastward expansion. Rome is now at peace with Carthage. Rome is now at war with the Scythians. Caravan mission with Rome complete. Hey, 600 bucks. I forgot about it. I had the caravan mission going. Look at that. We're close. We're close. I think I might sell some uh, metal and some, some food. Get me over that number. No. Queen Consort Marsha has departed this world. Moment of change. Contacts in Carthage and Egypt may be amenable to diplomatic discussion. No, you're going to want my money again, aren't you? Oh, they want food. Improve relations with Egypt, plus 40 opinion, send training points. I'm okay with that. I'm maxed out on training points and having a hard time <laughs> spending them. And uh, Egypt is our ally. Our, no, Egypt's not our ally. Greece is our ally. Hmm. Well, I definitely don't want to do it with Carthage. Carthage can go suck it. So I guess we will improve with Egypt or not right now. Uh, I don't care about Egypt either. Not right now. Give me XP. All right. Our chancellor died in office. We've got just enough points. Uh... Skirmish, Duke Nebuchadnezzar. So, we should uh, give him courage and charisma or wisdom and discipline. Currently, he's got wisdom and courage. Let's go with more wisdom and some discipline. Gift of the land, a princess consort, Etu. Um... Required her to be endeared. Oh, okay. So we're, she's losing the endeared status. So we're getting a reward for her being endeared with us. More border tiles in Babylon or sell the parcel to the highest bidders. Money! Look, I don't have to do it now. <laughs> I don't, I'll have to sell a tiny, tiny little bit. Give me some lumber. Oh, man. I would love to do that one. Too bad. We're not an engineer. We need 50 of the dollars. All right, you just need to step across the border. You. <clears throat> I love that they can hit him from here. <laughs> I can either get up in his grill and he's down to four health, or I can hit him from here. 
That's quite the distance. I need to get them the uh, marksman, sniper, I forget what the upgrade is. Do we have it? We don't have it. Oh, look at this. Steadfast. If only I had Steadfast earlier. But these are the last couple of fights we're going to have against Barbarians for quite a while. So, taking it would be a short-term benefit. I do love that Herbalist. That 10 hit points healing is so nice. Hmm. How are you going to do against these guys? You're going to do five, so we could we could kill them if I send both units in. Let's do that. I'm trying to keep out of his firing range, which we're good from either direction. We'll uh, we'll just park up here, finish him off. Nice. They've got a uh, silver mine right next to the, the center. All right, they're looking good. Next round, they'll come forward and we'll try to crush out the last of this barbarian encampment. Then we'll pivot and go take that one. I need to get one more settler queued up somewhere. Well, technically a couple of more. Because <laughs> we got this one back here and I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Uh, again, I need to bring some unit over to keep that from happening. Um, let's go see if we can... Ooh, perfect spot. He can't hit me yet. There's three units over there, which is going to force me to retreat. Unless I can pull units, or pull units out and kill them individually. I need one more unit over there as well. You are going to come forward and just keep an eye on these guys. Festival done, which just basically held things in place for a bit. Oh, before I do anything else. I wonder if I have to hold... Does it count instantly, or do I have to have 5,000 between end turn presses? Let's find out. Let's uh, sell some food. I'm going to sell 10. Another 10. You are now known as the Great. You've completed the ambition. Cool. All right, that helps. Rockpile 5,000. There we go. Five complete. Five to go. One queued up already, which is going to be a tough one. That one's going to suck. So we got halfway to an ambition victory and just over one quarter of the time allotted to us, but they're going to start slowing down now. Okay, we got cash. I don't have to worry about holding that any longer. I can uh, free up the cash coffers to purchase any stone or wood that I need for construction. That'll be nice. Get the forums going again. Or... I, I know I need settlers. I need at least one or two more military units. Let's get a chariot going. Forum two. <laughs> Stub, you are now known as the great choose a new ambition and celebration. <laughs> I guess they're still working on getting all of the, what is this Stub stuff? Interesting. Something seems to have gone a little wonky. Two max level units. Melee and ranged. Control 100 population. I'm at 35. Six governors. Ah, that I think I could do. That I think I can manage. I'm going to need a lot of civics. Now we're don't pick now. I'm going to take the governors. I think that one is achievable and one I would want anyway. That one's quite a ways off, and that one, I think I'm close. It says zero one out of zero one, but I think my elephants and my camel archers might be, or that uh, that chariot might be really close. 
Let me go look at these. I think he's only allowed... They're only allowed a certain number of promotions. I think he's he's only one away. Hey there, Chariot. He can still do one. Maybe it's you have to fill in all, all of these. I can't remember now. I don't remember what max level represents. But I know I've I've had some units in the past that I couldn't upgrade anymore. I think those are my two most likely. But I need a ranged unit too, which would be most likely the uh, archers here. And I think there's they're a ways away. Yeah, let's uh let's take the governors. All right, you. Let's see. I think I have enough power to finish these off. I'll have four combat units. These three will take this. They'll pivot. And then the four will be able to take that. I think I'm going to switch this. Let's, uh, let's cancel you. Let's get that other settler going. Need to get some more missions going too. So towards that end, it's going to be a while before we take that. So I'm going to bring this guy closer. So when we take this, I can drop the city, heal the units up and then march north. Otherwise I have to retreat them and then march. Very important. Take city site, drop settler, heal the advancing army, and then keep moving. So, move you up to there. Finished our mine. Um, we'll get the pasture. Need the orders. Not liking the choices. Out of orders. Um, is that a problem? <laughs> done, done, done. All the guys I wanted to fight are done. I think that's okay. Oh, here they come again. Free archer or keep working on the other stuff. Do I want him to be a schemer or a tactician? I think, didn't we pivot him? Affable, I guess we didn't. But he can still be uh, a good general. Tribe Slayer, acting independently of the military Duke Nebuchadnezzar. <laughs> Here we go, good start, huh? <laughs> um... Admonish Nebuchadnezzar for his recklessness. Celebrate the victories in the capital. He loses discipline. We get 21 bucks for 40 years. Truce with the Thracians. Gain triumph in Babylon. Definitely don't want to estrange him. Oof, and all families. Youch. All right, well... I also don't want a truce with the Thracians. Hmm. I think I'm going to pick Admonish him. I don't want the truce with the Thracians. I want to finish the last group off. 
So that's going to convert again in nine years if I don't get a unit sitting on top of it. I don't think he's strong enough to take the units that are over here on his own. That's the last of the Thracians that I'm aware of. Oh, and them. Yeah, I definitely don't want to, uh, to, to, to get a truce. So, no truce. But I can't do the truce. So, neither of the bottom two is going to work. Gotta, gotta admonish him. Bad Nebuchadnezzar. What were you thinking? Let's go down here first. Hey, we're up to 32 orders now. Uh, Barracks, Lumber Mill, and Grove. Good growth. Festivals completed. Those are also good. Got that. Got that. Alright, not worried about that. Do the important stuff first. Mr. Elephant. Go to there. Uh-oh. There's another one. So the river actually goes right on past, meaning these units up here, if I attack from this side, are going to have to attack across the river, which is going to suck. And I'm going to have to force march if I go any further. Yeah, this, this sucks a bit. Hmm. I'm already in range. She's going to hit me with both. You can't make it across the river without force marching also. And there's yet more units. All right. This is going to be a little, little ickier than I was hoping. Let's force march you to here. Hammer that group. Let's bring you forward and finish that group from here. Let's bring you this direction. Horse march also. Oh, yeah, lots of enemies. Um... Yeah, we gotta go for the secondary guys. Next round, we'll kill that, we'll kill that, and then we'll just be left with a fort and we'll be in better positioning. I wish I could have killed one more this round, because they're probably gonna do enough that I'll have to worry about my, my elephant. I don't think they can kill it. One and a half, one and a half, two and a half, yeah, they'll, they'll get me down about half, and then we'll finish them off. I'll probably have to retreat one and then finish the fort with the other two. That'll work. We'll have this cleaned up in a turn or two, and then we'll pivot and head north. You pull back there. 16 points still. I I think I'm gonna I'm gonna try to commit to this fight, I think. Unfortunately, it's gonna take me three turns to kill that guy. Which is too many. We've only got a 10% crit chance. Yeah, I, I don't think I can afford it. I won't be able to keep ahead of the damage. Not with at least three units over here. Let's just pull back, reset that. I gotta get one more unit over there to help him, basically. So what's going on. Uh, sure. Move the spy around a bit. More Scythians up north. You're still in good position. All right. What are we up to? Do I queue up another settler? It's not really the place to do it. Need some civics. I can get 8.4 per year doing that. Or I can get started on walls. Or another military unit. Let's uh let's queue up queue up an archer. I need to get some defensive units in place as well. Uh forums two, please. And Settler would be nice, but you're a long way from where I would need the settler to be.
Another forum too. Stronghold time. So we got the barracks up. We got the garrison up. Unlocks the Acadian Archer. I think that's one of our special specialty uh, units. All right, sure. Let's get uh, get the stronghold going. You, I need to connect up. Oh, so we're going to do a road pretty much right through here. Groves and farms and lumber mills. Oh, my. Out of points. See? Feast or famine on the orders. <laughs> One turn I have a whole bunch. Another turn I got nothing. This one charisma for the prince. So they did go after my elephant as expected. Got him down to a little tiny bit below half. Finished the garrison festival. Attacked, attacked, attacked. That's all expected. All right, so nothing interesting or new there. So this now is going to be ranged fire to kill that unit. Oh, wait, no, actually. I can stampede that unit, kill it, advance into its space, and then hit that. Ideally, I want to save the ranged fire for the fort because he does the most damage. The river bonus or river negative doesn't uh, isn't affected by uh, archery. Archery is not affected by the river. That is. So if I bring him over to here, we kill that, advance, and then I'll be able to hit that and kill it with the other elephant, I believe. Yeah. All right, so next turn, can I do four with the elephants? I cannot, the elephant's terrible at assaulting uh, fortified positions apparently. So it's gonna take me two rounds to kill that. He can't do enough to force my, my uh, camel archers to retreat in those turns, so this is all wrapped up. We'll be able to bring this elephant back and get him healed up. We'll bring the um, settler unit down to get this settled as soon as it's uh, clear. You are going to build the road this way. So we're, we're linking up the cities. This is not currently linked. That little symbol there shows linked connected to the capital so we're we can link via waterways or roads so this key shows the waterway or road connections so I'm connecting this waterway to this city center so I just need to build three or four more roads and then we'll be connected oh man we got a lot of a lot of workers up here <laughs> 
think maybe I'm going to run this guy south to Babylon, get a couple of workers in Babylon. I think that'd be more useful. Got to check my orders before I did that. Um, Let's wait on you for a second. You are going with another lumber mill. You're working on Grove. Got the garrison up. Um, really? Pasture is way the hell over there. Babylon, you're sure greedy with your borders. So the original intent with this setup was granary helping farms and then helping farms, but we've never managed to get <laughs> the the city to grow south so I can get the uh, farms built over here. Get another one built there. Let's do another settler unit out of here. <laughs> Whoops. Damn it. Didn't mean to hit that. Really didn't mean to hit that. Thought it was going to be another city or event. <laughs> Mouse moved faster than my eyes registered. It was on the end turn option. So we got our archer next up. Get the machinery with the onager. Okay, so uh, we might be able to take it. No, we can't take it this round either because the elephant's not going to be enough help. One and a half, one and a half. So. Not quite enough. Yeah, between the two of them, they'll get it next turn. Assuming no critical hits. I guess I might as well just keep fighting, because we're going to bring the settler in and settle, and I'll just heal right here. So, no reason to uh, leave. No crit! Oh, we could have had it this round. You can hit me from there, <laughs> cheesy bastard. I should probably move him back for a heal. That way he's ready for the big push on that last city. Free archer. Alright, let's send you down this way. Get you some support. Maybe with two units we can crack that spot. Um, need a worker of your own. Can't do you yet. You were coming down to do the farm. Sure. Sounds fun. All right. Uh, I forgot to chase down that whole... I got distracted and forgot to chase down that whole uh, <laughs> happiness for my family's thing. 208, 240, 240, or 236 is good. 
But missing luxuries, olives. So I need to figure out how to get olives to the, my Issen family. So if I click on the Issens. Trade and luxuries, family gifts. These are the Chancellor actions. There's got to be a way to do it. I just don't know where it's at. Um... really thought there'd be a way of doing it from here. Can't scroll the screen. No mention in here of it as an option. That's just basically giving them money. Cost me 400 bucks and two orders to have those percentage chances for, uh, for effects. But that's definitely not it. Um, ah, eligible governors, generals. I can look at this a little more often. Thought it might be here under trade mission, but that's to other countries. Family gifts. So, if I do family... Is it per city? Because that would be a little weird. No, that's that's the same gift thing. No mention of the... Uh, the resource. Either Jolly Roger... Where the hell... <laughs> do I tell these people they can have their... Their resource to make them happy. Um... I'm worried if I click on this. Yeah, see, it activated it. Cancel that. Hey, health screen. Can be traded to a city to reduce discontent. Can be traded to other nations, tribes, and families to improve their opinion. How? <laughs> How do? Where do? I have olives. I have olives. I have olive groves. And I'm trying to give olives and uh, lavender to my families, but I can't figure out where to actually initiate any of those kinds of actions. Not just for my families. I want to figure out how I, <laughs> how I do it for anybody. If I wanted to send tr trade to another country, for example. I mean, I've got trade mission, but I can't pick my own. I can't pick Babylon. So that's not going to do it. If I say trade mission Greece... See, that's just a generic trade mission, I believe. A trade mission event. That doesn't specify anything. 
So it's not that. Hmm. I need to figure this out. It's gonna be something obvious I'm missing. I can't think of what it is though. Uh, I mean, it's not that I can interact with the uh, the space. Where can I even see what luxuries I have available? There should be a screen somewhere where I can see what luxuries I've even got control of. But I can't find that either. Just the basic resources. I don't know. I'm... I'm at a bit of a loss. Let's resort to... think possibly I need to build a put a specialist on there I think they've changed it since the last time I played so the only thing I could think of is I need to build a specialist there I guess <laughs> it's the only thing that uh, comes to mind so the places I've got lavender, I need to keep an eye out. Like, that'll finish up. I, I'm building a settler and a settler. So, I'll, uh, yeah, I guess I'll try to... Let's see right here. Gardener specialist adds luxury olives. So, maybe building the, uh, developing the space... Possibly doesn't actually give me the, the luxury. The only thing I can think of. So, I'll uh, keep an eye out as I finish up my current, well, like, uh, form two in four years. Uh, yeah. Just remind me. <laughs> I'll keep an eye out. And next time I get to a city that's finished building something, if it's got a luxury, I'll, I'll start a specialist. Yeah, well, that's what I thought, but, um... Yeah. I don't think so. Well, they'll just be unhappy for now. Come on, game. Oh, lovely. Now it's not registering my end of year. <laughs> All right, what did I break? What have I done? Hmm. Weird. Somehow got stuck with that worker. Well, there's a problem. <laughs> Why am I no longer in alliance with Greece?
Greece is at war with Carthage, which is good. At war with Egypt. At war with the Vandals. Oh, yeah. Did uh, did somebody die? Queen Senat is dead. That shouldn't have affected it. My brother is ill. Our peace is over. No longer happy. I huh? guess they just decided to end our peace. Okay, then. Babylonia does not grovel. Neither of them is going to get me the alliance back, it looks like. All we can do is raise the opinion. So apparently I, I didn't raise my opinion fast enough. So that's unfortunate. I am, well, I mean, two legitimacy. I've got 211 now. I'm not too worried about the legitimacy loss. I'll go ahead and grovel. I'll take the plus 40. Athletic Games of the People of Babylon. Strong culture events. Oh, and I can't compete in the wrestling event myself. Because <laughs> I'm not between 18 and 40. Uh, so, preside over the games as judge. Gain charisma. A wager on the athletes. Gain wisdom. So, plus two... Eh, charisma or wisdom? Let's take charisma. Like mother, like daughter. Alright. Humble, inspiring, or foolish? Becomes inspiring. My poor elephants. Okay. Is it finally that time? Let's go with... Hmm. Fortunately, it's uh, only three spaces of urban with one f fourth in range. No other special resources than elephants and then the basic, well, and silver. So it's not terrible. I'm just trying to figure out... I want to attack with the elephants to finish him, settle the territory, preferably right where the elephants are sitting, and then run these guys north to start doing damage up here. So, let's do that. Bring you across. Found, uh, I did the sages last time, I believe. So yeah, Chaldeans. Mines and lumber mills. That's perfect. For that spot, we got a silver mine. We got hills. We got uh, trees. So, sounds good. Enjoy your new city. Then next round, we can tell the elephant to heal. And this round, we can move some units. So, we've got that part of it. Oh, see? Carthage. <laughs> he did manage to get over there before I could get there. He just took the site. He hasn't settled it yet. But, yeah, this is going to be our dividing line right here. All right, no big surprise there. Let's make sure we go take that before he gets over here. I can get all the way up to here and start shooting him. His range is to there. I can hit him from here without him hitting me. Well, that sounds like fun. Bring you across. And bring the other elephants forward. Okay. And I do not have a settler waiting for that spot. We're, we're going to be stuck waiting. Let's see. It's going to take me... That's dead next round. I think there's at least one more unit out here. It's going to take me maybe two, three rounds to finish it. So the timing's not too bad. We'll just sit on the site to hold it until the settler's done. I'll probably pull one or two units back for the long run to help out back here. Uh, Where did that archer go? Where did you go, archer? What was our happiness with Greece, anyway? 
I, I gained 40. So we were at, uh, what, negative 100 and something? Probably at negative 100 it is when it canceled. I was wondering, because we were negative when we uh, gained the alliance, which seemed a little strange. I probably should have focused and tried to do a trade mission or something to raise uh, status so we didn't lose the alliance. That was probably a screw-up. That was most definitely a screw-up. There's the archer. All right, get down here. We need to march through some forest. You're fine. Whoops. Nope, you can move. Uh, doo -doo. Time to relocate you forward. Let's put you up here. Youch. Youch. Hmm. That's a little worrying. Who's at war with who? Uh, Xanthippe is at war with Carthage. Cool. He's got an awful lot of units down south. You're also at war with Greece. <laughs> it's got three wars going on, but he's got all these units down here. Croatians, I can understand. But he's at war with Greece and with Egypt. Uh, way up here. Uh, I guess Egypt's not really that much of a threat. So yeah, I'm a little concerned at the uh, the strength shown over here. Idle City, this is my forward city we just founded. We need to get the forum up so we can build the other things quicker. I also need to get a defender in here so that I can move the elephant without worrying about somebody coming to knock the walls down. Hmm. No, do the forum. We'll uh, we'll try to bring somebody forward. You are did the pasture. No other adjacent pastures. Not going to be able to get much in the way of bonuses to that. If we were going to build a lumber mill, it would be up by the water. Anywhere. I need to get the governors in place, too. I keep forgetting that. Alright, go there. Harrison. Last road. Should be the last road, I think. Yep. Little symbol just appeared. Now we have to do another road. <laughs> oh, actually, we don't have to do another road. I forgot. The river here connects us to that city as well. So that's now connected. This is going to be the one that's a pain in the ass. I got no waterways anywhere near that. So that's going to either be a long-ass road across there or a not-quite-as-long road here. Uh, wait. Yeah, wait till the archer can move. You are good. Um, you already did most of your things. Looks like you can still move, though. Hmm. I think I'm gonna move him down the road. Hopefully I remember. Keep moving east. Go go help out the front city. Alright, so that's everybody. Uh what did I want to look at? I wanted to look at I need to get military upgrades done, which is hopefully going to happen as soon as we finish this. We'll have military units 
in place up front that we'll just get to upgrade, 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 and we'll burn through some of this. I also needed to get governors in place. Borsippa, you've got your governor. You do not. Farms and groves. Oh, we got farms and groves. That's a good one. We'll, we'll let him be the governor there. I think we don't have anybody else we can do, or we're, we're missing the garrison still. All right, so how close are we? Four out of six. I need two more. And I've got to start getting settler, uh, get the uh, citizens put into specialist positions. Really, really need to start focusing on that. See how powerful it is compared to continuously building more and more structures. The benefit there is it doesn't cost resources. So you accumulate your resources back up, but you still get an enhancement in the output. And we can meet some of these other, other requirements. All right, before I continue, well, actually, I will continue. And we're going to put a save in. As soon as it done, turns done processing, I'll take my midstream break. And we'll uh, we'll go forward from there. Uh, head of the Babylonian Paganism. Spy Master converted. A lot of conversions. All right. Before we do anything, save as... Vorm 3. All right, I will uh, be back in just a few.